My boyfriend said something I think is unforgivable but I can't lose another loved one. I, 22 meters, have been with my BF, 22 meters, for 4 years. It was not love at first sight as I didn't know I was bi at the time. I met my BF when I was 18 and as I said I didn't know I was bi so we started of as friends though. With time I realized that you felt something more. When I saw him flirting with another guy in front of me I got jealous and pulled him to the side. And confessed how I felt. To my surprise he felt the same and I felt like the luckiest guy in the world. Never ever thought I could love someone as much as I loved him. Now I come from a conservative background and my parents weren't exactly happy when they found out about it. I love my family and respect them with ever fiber of my being. To my surprise they didn't want to disown me and told me they still loved me and that they just needed time. I was so happy about it and thought everything would work out. My BF hates my family so much for even thinking it's wrong to be bi. I don't blame him but I told him that they are trying and doing their best despite him hating them. And making it hard on me we still decided we should move in together at the end June 2021. Three months ago I lost my parents in a car crash. Thankfully my little brother, seven, was with me at the time. I just shut down. Couldn't eat. Couldn't think and refused to go outside. I just wanted to be with my brother and work through my grief. My BF was happier than ever. Like the news of my parents' deaths was like winning the lotto. I convinced myself that it was my anxiety messing with me. Two days ago my brother came running to me. Telling me that my BF told him he shouldn't be sad and that them dying would make his life easier. Now that their beliefs won't be pushed on to him. His exact words, be happy or brother will teach you better than they would. I lost it. Told him to leave and I didn't want him in my life anymore. The thing is he made me feel guilty about it and made it sound like I'm overreacting and being dramatic. I'm still depressed today and can't trust myself and my friends are divided. Some think I should leave him and the other says I should forgive him bc I have already lost too much. I think I should leave him and I probably would under normal circumstances but I he was the best and sweetest person I have ever met. What should I do? Are you seriously not breaking up with a person who can be that fucking cruel to a child who lost both parents? Some things are unforgivable. He was the best and sweetest person I have ever met. If this was true, he wouldn't say what he said to an actual child that recently lost their parents. Fuck this guy. Seriously. He fucked with your family. Absolutely. Completely. Unequivocally. Unforgivable. Religion is one of the biggest differences between people in a relationship. But that said, your boyfriend was an utter piece of shit for saying that to your brother. Kick your boyfriend to the curb. I don't care how sweet this guy has been to you in the past you and your brother went through. Something devastating and your boyfriend is having the time of his life. Telling a child he should be happy his parents are dead is despicable. Fuck him. That is such an inconsiderate and awful thing to say to someone who just had lost their parents. How is his relationship with his own parents? Does he care about your feelings at all? I would leave him ASAP. Would not let anyone talk about my dead family members that way. I'm sorry for your loss. I can't imagine what you're going through. Your. Ex. BF is fucking trash. Someone who can openly celebrate fatal family drama trauma including your hurt. Is someone not deserving of your time. Let alone your love. And then he puts the cherry on top by telling this shit to your brother. Telling a seven yo. Child to be happy about his parents death. Trash. Just human trash. And all because your parents disagreed with his sexuality.
Let that sink in for a second. OMG please leave. He was pleased that your family died and is emotionally hurting your brother. If you don't leave for yourself leave for your brother. Telling your partner and his family they should be happy their parents are dead should be a deal breaker. His hatred for your parents is clearly greater than his love for you otherwise he would have never said that. Here's a little perspective. My husband's father is a scumbag and a con artist he steals money. He got my husband into heroin. Husband is sober now. When he was a child, he abandoned his family and left them to live in a motel. He uses women for a place to live. He left his last girlfriend while she overdosed and died. I've thought to myself that he was a horrible person and I wish he didn't exist but I've never wanted him to die let alone tell my husband that or his little brother. And I especially would never say something like that if he actually did die. What your boyfriend did is so unbelievably terrible and I would absolutely dump him. Your brother needs you now more than ever. Do you really want him around someone who is gleeful over your parents' death? Someone who has reacted so callously. He is no longer the best or sweetest person you know. He has shown you who he actually is. You should leave him. What he said to your brother was horrible and unforgivable. There is no coming back from it. Your parents may have been homophobic assholes. But they were human beings and they were your brother's parents. Your boyfriend's words show him to be monstrously lacking in compassion. Perhaps to the point of having a personality disorder. I honestly can't imagine any emotionally healthy person every saying that to a grieving child. Leave him, in the short term it'll hurt, in the long term you'll find a more compassionate partner. Your, sweetest person you've ever met, has basically told your seven why, oh brother they're happy your parents are dead. This is a no-brainer. Dump his ass. This is not a discussion. That, is not okay. Your boyfriend has been awful to you and to your brother. And gaslights you when you get rightfully pissed. This is abusive and toxic and it isn't doing you any good. You don't have to accept abuse because your parents died. Have you got therapy for you and your brother? Therapy is probably a good idea. This is 100% unforgivable. He is a jackass. He was the best and sweetest person I have ever met. Clearly this was all an act he was putting on. Leave him. That has got to be one of the most vile things I've ever heard of. Honestly even if your parents had fully disowned you out it would still be a horrible thing to say to a child and a partner. You should leave him, whatever his feelings about your parents. If he was truly a partner to you he would have recognized that you and your brother were in pain and grieving and done what he could to help you through that. Instead all he thought about was how the loss of your parents benefited him. The complete lack of empathy he displayed in telling a grieving seven-year-old that he should be happy. His parents are dead as unbelievable. You can't get new parents. But you can sure as hell get a new boyfriend. Don't spend your time with someone who has shown you then when you're in pain they're happy to rub. Salt in the wound. It's for the best to leave him. That was super cruel to say to someone about their parents nevertheless a seven-year-old. You don't need that kind of toxicity around you or your brother. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epic Eracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.